Hey, this is Leslie here again today. I'm going to show you how I make uh, three types of alcohol inks. These are really easy to make and very affordable. They're very economical. We're going to start out. We're going to need alcohol, some pens, some pastel crayons, some permanent markers, some pliers, a pair of scissors, and three containers for our inks. We're going to start out with our first recipe, alcohol and pen ink. We're going to pull out the little ink tube out of the pen with a pair of pliers, and we're going to cut the little tube ink into our container like so. Be careful, don't do what I just did. <laughs> Make sure you get all the tube all the way to the bottom, to this little section right there. You want to get all the ink out of this little tube. And make sure that when you're cutting the little tube, you get that little top part. It has a little plug there that prevents for the ink from uh, drying or spilling out when, while it's in the pen. Just make sure you do get it so that all the ink can come out. Okay, you ready to add your alcohol? Okay, close it up and we're just gonna let it sit there. The longer it sits, the more ink that comes out of the little tube. Give it a quick shake. You can see the ink's already coming out. This is what it looks like once it's been sitting for a couple hours. It's really dark and rich. Be careful, it does stain, so just keep that in mind. Okay, on to our second recipe. This is alcohol and pistol, my favorite ultimate ink. For this one, you're gonna need a little spray bottle. Your alcohol. And your pastel crayon just cut it in half snap it in half with your fingers really easy and place it in the alcohol see all the little bubbles that's because it's gonna soak and disintegrate in there close it up and let it soak this is what it's gonna look like once it's uh, completely disintegrated it's gonna settle every time when it's not in use, so don't worry about it if it looks uh, a little strange. But all you have to do is give it a shake before you use it, and you're ready to go. And this is what it looks like when, when it's in use. I love working with um, pastel ink, and it dries super quick since it is alcohol. This is the look I go for when using pastels, or this ink anyway. I love, love how it looks. The misty matte finish is um, something I really like when I do my work. Here's the blue ink since it's been sitting there for a couple, I want to say about a couple hours. I'm going to spray some on the, on the paper so you can see what it looks like. All you have to do is give it a shake every time you use it. I'm gonna let it dry so you guys can see the final result. Look at this, how beautiful. This for a background journal, um, background journal work or for any kind of artwork, it is amazing. I love this ink. And there you have it, pastel inks. Okay, on to the third recipe, this alcohol and permanent marker. You need a little container. And with a um, pair of pliers, just pull out the felt tip. We're going to use the felt tip because it is uh, soaked with ink and we want to get all the color ink out of, as much color ink as possible out of these markers or out of anything that you want to get the ink out of. Okay, just pull um, 
your marker apart really easy and get the cotton tube out of there and just cut it into pieces. Add your alcohol. And give it a little shake. The ink's already coming out, as you can see. I have a blue one here that I'm gonna show you what it looks like when in use. These are much lighter than the regular pen ink. They look pretty nice too. And there you have it, three types of uh, alcohol inks that you can make yourself. Really easy to make, very economical, and they look absolutely adorable when you're doing a lot of um, mixed media or anything that you want to incorporate it in. If you like my videos, please click here for my last video, and please don't forget to share and subscribe. If you have any comments or questions, let me know.